Hey guys, Rob here with American Patriot Preppers, and here's another project I'm starting on. I'm going to transform this area into a parking spot for my truck. Here I flattened out some spots and put some sand down with limestone and packed it all down uh, mainly for drainage purposes underneath all where the boards are going to go so the water can uh, drain off properly and not hold any inside this area. I also did the same right underneath where the landscape timbers are going to set. Uh, got it all nice and ready to go and uh, ready for the next step of nailing these this first layer of landscape tempers with 12 inch nails to the ground to kind of keep them in place for now. These are the tools you're going to need for the next step of nailing the first layer down. Uh, I'm going to show you guys what the caulking is for in just a second. First thing you're going to do is drill your holes out for your 12 inch nails. And I did about three per board on the uh, landscape timbers. Uh, that's just to hold it in place temporarily. And before I dump the limestone in, I'm going to go ahead and stake the back side of this just to hold it all in place so it doesn't push out. All right, here's the caulking. I go ahead and fill each hole uh, completely up with caulking. This is just going to coat the inside with some waterproofing just to help it last a little bit longer from the rot. Since this is the bottom board, it's going to hit get most of the water. So hit every hole and then go on to the staking. Once all your holes are filled, go ahead and start staking the 12 inch uh, nails into the ground. Uh, first, make sure your boards are set and lined up exactly where you want them. Once you have your first row set and staked, you're going to cut one of your 8 foot long landscape timbers directly in half and start your second row stacked on top of your first row of landscape timbers. You're going to set your first four foot piece on the top and then follow that up by your eight foot pieces until you get to the end of the line. This stagger method will help ensure you lock all your pieces together. Then you're going to get your three and a half inch screws and countersink those down into the top piece to lock everything solid. Once you're done with your eight foot pieces and when you get to the end, your other four foot piece that you cut should line up perfectly at the very end to finish your two rows of landscape timbers. If you want, you can come back and caulk the top of all your screw holes just to help with the uh, rotting of the wood so no water gets in and kind of uh, this helps prolong the life of your landscape timbers. And that's pretty much it for now. I'm going to come back with some 2x4 stakes to sure up the back side of all this and I'll order about 60 cubic feet of limestone and dump it in here, spread it out and start packing it down so I can have a nice little spot to park my truck. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more stuff. Yeah.